Hi and welcome to another video. Today we'll look at sunshine from lizard bite, which in combination with moonlight uh, can make in-home streams possible with uh, your AMD GPU and with NVIDIA and Intel GPUs too. So um, it's a very good um, in-home streaming service. So um, you can stream your games from your PC to another devices like uh, smart TVs or laptops or so or other Linux computers whatever. Um, I used a lot of mm, streaming services and they were not very good. The AMD one, the AMD link I can show you. Here are settings and the link and it's also very simple to set up but AMD link uh, has always dropped uh, some frames and uh, it was not very good playable for me so I decided to go with sunshine and what is sunshine? Sunshine is a self-hosted game stream host for Moonlight offering low latency cloud gaming service there are capabilities with support for AMD, Intel and NVIDIA GPUs for hardware encoding. Software coding is also available. You can connect to Sunshine from any Moonlight client on a variety of devices. And so on, okay. Um, yeah, I will post the link in the, the description, but it's uh, very simple to read GitHub dot com slash lizardbyte slash sunshine then you go to downloads and use uh, sunshine windows installer.exe once you've executed it um, and installed it you have to restart your PC because um, when you don't your controller won't be recognized on the first run what happened to me but it's no problem uh, so restart your PC, then go to Sunshine Foreground mode, it will start. And then, here in the taskbar, we can open Sunshine. On the first run, it will mm, ask you for a username and a password, which you'll input, and then you will be getting to this configuration uh, website which uh, runs on localhost and um, you have to um, enable unsure connections on Chrome or Internet Explorer or whatever but once you've done that um, you can then go to configuration for example and set up a lot of things but uh, a very important thing for AMD GPUs is that you go to uh, configuration advanced and force a specific encoder. Here you go from auto detect to AMD AMF VC that will force Sunshine to use GPU encoding on your AMD GPU. So um, once you've done that, you can go to applications uh, and set up uh, a new application like that. Um, put in a name. And here you um, will have to input the exe of the game and save it. Once that uh, is done, we can see uh, TLU for example. The command is uh, like this, so the exe of the game. Uh, then you go to save and um, in Moonlight it uh, will show this application so you can start it from there. Okay, um, we are then done with configuration and I'll do a quick um, phone video to show you Moonlight in action. Um, I could use uh, um, OBS of course, but um, I think that with um, the smartphone video it's also uh, viable. Okay. See you again. 
So welcome back. I have um, started my laptop device, which is an Asus Tough Gaming F15. And I've installed Moonlight and started it here on Moonlight. Then the first thing is that we go to settings, select 1440p or enable a custom resolution if you are on an ultra wide client and an ultra wide um, server, for example. But we will now go to 1440p and enable 120 FPS. If your connection is not so um, capable of 120, then you can do 30 or 60 FPS, whatever. But at 120 FPS, uh, it will default to 80 Mbps. Um, what is a cool feature is that we can disable vSync, so we got a, a better uh, input. And yeah, then we go to our desktop and start the TLU that we previously input in Sunshine. And this will start uh, The Last of Us, but we can go to desktop and start the game from there, I suppose. So let's start it. Um, another note is that if you have an ultra wide monitor and your client is not an ultra wide monitor, uh, but a 16 to 9 aspect ratio, then you have to change the um, desktop resolution on your PC to make it 1440p, so otherwise you will have black bars at the top and bottom. And yeah, let's progress with the game. Okay, mm, I have um, enabled controller input and the input lag is very low and the quality of the picture is very good too. Uh, maybe it's not showing on the f um, phone camera correctly, but it's way better than AMD Link and um, way better than Steam Link because on Steam Link I would have a very bad frame rate or input lag and on AMD Link 2 so this is way better and um, the quality is uh, better too on Moonlight and yeah I can recommend you to download and try out Moonlight in conjunction with Sunshine. It's working very well and see you on the next one.